In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create confidential and password protected emails inside of your Gmail. Hey guys, welcome back to Google Tutorials where we give you the best tips and tricks to grow your confidence online. If you're new here, please consider subscribing so that you're the first to get notified every time we launch a brand new video. If you haven't watched the Gmail playlist so far, there'll be a link in the description box below as well as in the iCard in the top right of your screen. When you're sending confidential information, be it files, documents, or even just an email with confidential information inside of it, you want to make sure that it's secure. And Gmail has a feature inside of it allowing you to set an expiry date for that email and to even password protect those emails. To do this, all you need to do is to compose an email like you'd do normally by clicking compose at the top left. Then you'd type in the email as you would normally. Then to turn it into a confidential email, all you need to do is go down to the bottom of your Gmail, then go to the padlock icon with a clock next to it. Then it will open this box, which you can set an expiry date. For example, expires in one day, one week, one month, expires in three months or five years. Then right next to it is the date it will expire on. The next option underneath it is require passcode. And what this is, is basically it's going to password protect your email that the recipient of this email will have to either enter a password if they want to access it. It is followed by two options, which says no SMS passcode or SMS passcode. No SMS passcode will email the person a passcode, which they can access for a little while until this email expires, which in this case is going to be Tuesday. But if you want it to be even more secure, you can SMS their passcode to them using their phone. If you want more information about the passcode feature in the confidential mode, all you need to do is click on the question mark icon and it will tell you more about it in a box. Finally, when you're done, click the blue save button at the bottom right. Now, as you can see, the email has changed a bit. Banner has changed color and it will say the content expires and then the date. To edit the passcode option or the expiry date, all you need to do is click edit next to it. And this is what the email will look like for the person who receives it. It will have the main information and then the content expiry date underneath. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe as we've got a ton more content just like this. And check out the Gmail playlist if you're interested, shown on screen now. Or if you're looking for another video by Google Tutorials, click or tap the screen right now. And I'll see you soon.